إن علينا للهدى وإن لنا للآخرة والأولى. You've found the truth, which is Islam, right? Yes. I will say to you to affirm it. It's very simple. Yes. All you have to say to become Muslim, right, is that you have to say, I bear witness. There's nothing worthy of worship except Allah in truth and the Prophet Muhammad is the final messenger. You say this in the English and you say this in the, um, uh, in the um, Arabic language, yes? And then you are Muslim, yes? It's a safety net, look, it's like a safety net. If something happens to you, because death is a certainty. We don't know when death, death will come to us, yes? I could die tonight. I could literally be hit, hit, hit by a bus whilst going home, right? So it's about saving yourself from the hellfire. If you believe that it's time is the truth, yes? 100%. You know, we don't have any doubt. Yes? And you believe that the Prophet Muhammad is the final messenger. Yes? And Jesus is the Prophet, yes? And he's not God. You we don't pray to him. I was Christian, but then I stopped believing in Christianity. I was Christ. Um, yeah. Okay, so you moved away from Christianity. So you, so you don't believe that Jesus died for your sins and these things. Believe that that Allah is the only one that can forgive our sin. Yes. Yeah. So if you believe this, it's what's in your heart. It it is uttered upon the tongue. And then you would step into the fold of Islam, yes? So, thing is, I would urge you to say this because tomorrow is not guaranteed for anyone. That's why it's very important to, to, to take your shahada and then step by step, you can learn how to pray, okay? Don't do everything at once, right? Just take your shahada and then, okay, Alhamdulillah, Muslim now, yeah? I took my shahada, amazing, and then kind of just, just, just kind of accept that, and then slowly, slowly learn how to pray. Yes, because it's very important to accept Islam. So that's why, that's why because because if you said to me, look, I'm not sure. I said, okay, no problem. Do your research. Yes, but you have conviction and and certainty. Yes, but you you have certainty about Islam. Yes. So that's why I'm saying that if you like to become Muslim, all you have to do is, is repeat after me, yes? Okay? Is that okay? Okay? So you repeat after me, yeah? You say, I bear witness. There's nothing worthy of worship except Allah. And the Prophet Muhammad is the final messenger of Allah. So now I say this in the Arabic language, I'll say it slowly. Yeah? Say, Ashhadu an, an, Ashhadu an, an, la, ilaha, illallah, wa Ashhadu anna, Muhammadan, abduhu, abduhu, wa rasulahu. How do you feel? Good, yeah? So Alhamdulillah, now you're a Muslim. It's very really a simple thing. I don't know why they told you to go to the mosque. Uh, I don't know why they did that. But once you find Islam as the truth, then you accept it, yes? So now you feel quite peaceful, and you know, because the thing is that if you are sincere to these words, Allah has forgiven all your past sins. Allah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala doesn't need to kill, kill his son or like doing all these things, right? Allah is the most merciful that Allah has just forgiven all your sins and because you were a Christian before and you accepted Islam Allah has converted your sins into good deeds right so Allah has forgiven all your sins right and as I was saying before because you said the words yes inshallah one day you would enter paradise so now because you have faith in those words, inshallah you will enter paradise. Yes? So so how how did you find Islam? How was this all your journey? Um, from friends. 
Yeah. So you're of many Muslims. And they taught you about Islam yeah. and these things, yes? Okay, that's nice. So your friends kind of introduce you towards Islam, right? So, inshallah, so just focus on learning how to pray. Do you have, because you have peace in your heart at the moment, yes? Yeah. This, is, this is something that only occurs when you remember Allah. So peace and tranquility is not in a materialism, money, whatever, drugs or alcohol, yes? It's in the remembrance of, of Allah. So the true Muslim, when they have a heaviness in their heart, they would worship Allah. And that could be the, you know, reciting the Quran and praying Salah, yes? Many ways. But the Salah is supposed to be the coolness of our eyes. So when we, so if you were you like to continue having that peace in your heart, then it's very important to pray. The prayer brings peace and tranquility to the heart. Yes? So, so inshallah, do you have friends that can help you to like learn how to pray and stuff, yeah? yeah. Is your friend Muslim? Yes. yes, mashallah. So she taught you about Islam, yeah? Well done. Do you practice yourself? Do you pray? I do. Sorry? I do. Yes, excellent. So, so, so inshallah, maybe you can teach her, teach her how to pray? Yes. Yes, right. Step by step, take it easy with her. Don't just like give her too much information, yeah? yeah?